Okay, so I want to introduce uh, a new practice called spontaneous thinks. This is a just noting practice. In, in this practice, we're just going to be notice, noting thank you. So that's the very simple basic instruction. Um, before we get into more of a description of the technique and the details of it, I wanted to just share how this technique came about. Um, this came about during a um, low dose psychedelic meditation experience. Um, as several other social noting techniques have. And in those experiences, you know, if you've ever been either on a meditation retreat or done psychedelics, you've been in an altered state where there's a sense of unity, um, of kind of your individual self sense sort of being more kind of dissolved or more permeable. You'll, you'll know this experience of things just kind of arising. There's just this quality of things are just happening. Uh, just happeningness. And, and while I was in this sort of group practice, uh, we were doing some social noting, we were moving, we were spontaneously, you know, kind of writhing on the floor. We were just kind of going with the experience. And, um, and what I noticed started happening is that people would be randomly saying out loud, thank you. And it occurred to me after the fact, like, oh, it'd be great to be able to take that sp spirit of what emerged naturally and spontaneously in that experience and formalize that into a practice. And it seemed like just noting to me would be a good container for that, a good way to do that. And it's, uh, so, so this is, I just, I want to share this because one, I want to be honest about the origins of these techniques and just sort of acknowledge that psychedelics have played an important role, uh, at least for me, in the development of, of social noting. And also that part of what I get most curious by and find most helpful in the end are practices that arise um, not from my mind, but arise from practice, from group practice, from spontaneous emergence. And then being able to kind of recognize that, those, those patterns when they emerge and say, oh, well, how could we practice that? How could we formally practice that? So since that time, Emily and I have been doing this practice together as a regular part of our you know, communal shared practice. And I've just found it to be a really beautiful um, way to practice. Uh, so simple, just saying thank you, just noting thank you. Um, and, and for me, it feels very much like a heartfulness practice as well as a mindfulness practice. It feels like it's a heart mindfulness type of orientation. And it, in particular with the heart quality uh, of gratitude, you know, that's what it really seems to elicit um, for folks. And so this is a great practice for cultivating and developing gratitude. Um, and, and very importantly, um, there's no specification here on who the you is. So the you is very open. It's the instructions don't, don't specify. Um, that's often a question, well, who am I thinking? Well, or what, or whatever. And there isn't a set answer to that in the instructions. That's part of the exploration of this practice. 